I grew up right here in Grand Forks, played all my youth hockey here in Grand Forks. I mean, I grew up watching UND, but at the same time, I grew up watching my brothers play a lot of high school hockey, and you know, they won the state championship when I was 10, 11, 12 years old, and you know, really, the, the, my goal was to win a state high school hockey championship. Weber, and that was Tim Scarprood with that tough angle shot. Out of the blue, you're like, oh, I guess I'm coming to UND, and definitely a dream come true, because I definitely dreamt about it, but I never thought it would ever happen. I remember that first time I stepped on the ice at the old Ralph, it was an exhibition game against Manitoba, and the chills and the, and the just goosebumps that you had stepping on the ice, that's a feeling that I'll never forget uh, that first time I stepped on the ice. <laughs> my second year in, in the AHL, I, I tore my ACL, and then once, uh, had to rehab the rest of the year, and then we came back home and decided it was time to, to start a family and, and start the real world. Paid receipt. Okay. There's the binder. Well, I work here at Baller Insurance in Grand Forks. I've been here for four or five years. Sell insurance, insurance agent here in town. We focus a lot on commercial insurance, personal insurance, and, and uh, been here for four or five years. You know, my wife's a teacher in town here. She's, she's uh, loves the Grand Forks school system. And it just, it just made sense for us. We're both from Grand Forks. We're high school sweethearts. It just made sense for us to come back to, to Grand Forks and raise our family. Hey Ann, this is Tim from Baller Insurance. Good, how are you? Well, I was elected to the park board last week. Um, you know, I was very happy and pleased that uh, people around the community are, are have faith in me to, to help out and, and give back to the community. I'm looking forward to it. Obviously, I got, I got a lot of, out of all the, the park board activities. It's gonna be good to, to give back and hopefully expand on what they're doing. Anything that we can provide to youth to uh, get them involved, it, uh, it really will help out the community. I think my biggest thing is, you know what, just work hard and have fun. There's a lot of things that are out of your control. Uh, just go out there, have fun with it, and work hard. Not a lot of people will get a chance to play uh, where they want to play or end up playing where they want to play. But you know what, there's a lot of life lessons that can be learned from, from sports and activities. And you know what, have fun with it, grow some relationships and just work hard at what you're doing and, and whatever happens, happens.